Well, hello everybody. It is Sai here for Plan With Me for Unravel and Unwind. And holy holographic rainbows, what is in front of us today? This is the one and only Faze Planner. She had a planner gifted to her by one of her daughters for Christmas one year, and uh, she did start using it but then didn't for a while and then she got a nice one um as well from her uh, her other half for christmas last year which she loved and really got a lot of use out of and now i've been haranguing her for a long long time to go and get this out of storage so that i can pimp it for her and then she'll have a perpetual planner like me. I'm a little jealous, not gonna lie, because this is a paper chase item. I love paper chase, but also it is full on true A5. It is not A5 slim. It's the real thing, it's, it's full size. Now this is, um, this is what was left of it after, um, after she cleaned it out. So let's just have a little looky see what's in here for a start. Okay, we've got dailies. Look at that, smashing it 24 7. So we've got daily stuff. Um, and I remember doing this with her because these are my journal stamps that I got from Wish ages ago, which we haven't actually used on here. Um, but I do I do occasionally use them. Um, this, oh, look at this. We got morning, afternoon, evening things as well. I don't know if she's going to use these. I might retitle them and put different sections in for things that she needs to keep track of or accomplish in the day. But I don't think it's going to be a morning, afternoon, evening thing at all. I think it's going to be like different, different types of things. You know, like uh, social media, uh, design work, sales, um, Patreon, things like that. So um, that's just me thinking uh, right away. And I'm sure Faye is watching this video because she watches all my Plan With Me videos, don't you, Faye? Um, so she's probably going to have some input on this. Um, basically, I'm just looking through to see what there is and what I would like to change about what there is because I think it's important not to waste anything. And uh, so we're gonna make the most use out of what we've got. Now, that's daily, then there's weeklies. So, oh, this is where the smashing it 24 seven went. Okay, so that's, that's a weekly layout, which is good. Okay, so that doesn't go in dailies, that goes in weeklies. Then you've got your calendar, which must be month to view, and that, well, there are months in here. Oh, look, there's white ones and rainbow ones. Interesting. Okay, so I know, oh, and look at this. Okay, this is very interesting to look at because I don't know if, if the sharp eyed of you are noticing this, but you gotta be careful when you're using this thing because each of these pages has four columns but there's only seven days in a week. Eek. So already you've really got to think about what you're doing. Now, if I did something with these, um, I could get my stamps out. I could do some decorating, um, that kind of thing. I'm, I'm considering what I'm gonna use each of these for because um, we keep track of a lot of things that Unravel and Unwind and part of this is going to be a business planner for Faye. Um, so I'm thinking maybe we can use like the colors for one thing and we can use the white, black and white ones for other things. I don't know. This is very interesting um, because I'm thinking we need at least two monthly layouts to cover everything that goes on. Um, busy place, unravel and unwind. Um, and then we've got obviously notes section which I can, I can add all kinds of fun stuff. And then there's a contacts list, which Faye didn't even know was here when we took a look at it yesterday. Um, but it is nice because it's got room for emails, Instagram, Twitter, website, URLs, 
So that's a cool idea, although I have to say, I think a website needs a little more room than that. So <laughs> I don't know, maybe someone's not not thinking over at Paper Chase, but you know what? Close enough. It's a really nice, really sweet rainbow planner that you can use. Um, and oh, it's, it's great. So there's some cool stuff in here. Um, got some neat, like inspirational stickers that were in here. And, uh, I bought a job lot of these little post-it markers. So they're in there. Um, this is a, this goes back a long way. Um, we used to do something called my shining year, and this is a daily sort of tracker sheet. So, um, you've got your eight glasses of water down the side right there. Um, you've got your gratitude space, um, to do list three most important tasks. This is a really great, and it says learn, connect, eat greens, meditate, make and create and move. So it's, you know, all the basic things you need to do in a day. That's going to be fun too. I told her that I would, if she had a particularly busy day, wanted to use one of these because it's on a gummed pad. Um, I was going to uh, punch some holes in the whole pad so that it can be here in the back and then she can just use it when she wants. So that's my plan anyway. And there's some pretty sort of art things that she wants to keep and that'll be cool to decorate dividers with. And wow, I love these. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> the toast. <laughs> Let's get smart. <laughs> Look at this lovely. I love it. This is this is fun. This is fun looking actually. Really love it. Um, and there's plenty of little reminder stickers and bits and bobs. So we'll see how many of these we can sort of make use of as well. Um, sounds like fun. So I think what I'm going to be doing with this is um, it's mostly a biz planner. Um, with room for personal stuff as well. Um, but I know how all encompassing the business is right now and it does need a planner of its own really, but we shall see. Um, this is exciting for me, not gonna lie. Um, and I've got some extra sort of paper that was lying around at the studio that happened to make it into storage. So I can use some of this happy colors and all kinds of stuff to make with and uh it is oh i love this stuff have you have you seen this this is mulberry paper that's what they call it i don't know why i don't know if it has anything to do with mulberries but it's so much fun to use this um usually in a, a decoupage situation where you're just loading everything with mod podge and throwing things down um because it is so it's it's so thin that the adhesive shows through so but it's it's such a it's fun to work with. I really really love it. So um, that's gonna be fun. I think I'm gonna get really the the biggest sort of artistic sort of fun stuff is gonna be on the dividers because the dividers are more permanent than the rest of it. But also, um, a lot of the creation is gonna end up being um, on the computer. I think because if we make some some A5 um, pages here to, uh, what am I, I've lost my words today. If we make some A5 pages that we're gonna want to replace over time and use again and again and again, it might make more sense to design and save these things. And uh, who knows, if you wanna buy them, maybe we'll let you buy them, uh, you know, but that's, it's something we mused about yesterday that um, actually does sound pretty cool. So, um, yeah, the first thing I am going to do, because I've never done this for anyone else before, okay, but it might be kind of a cool thing to help people with. Um, I mean, I've, I've shown people, I've given people prompts, uh, questions to ask themselves about what they want in a diary, but I haven't gone any further than that with people. I've just said, you know, what are your goals? Do you want to keep track of these goals? What what do you want to do every single day? Um, once a day, every single day for yourself? Um, where's your me time? You know, I, I, I did that in my plan with me workshops, but this is a totally different kettle of fish because I've been given an empty planner and I need to plan. Crazy. Um, so 
the thing I'm going to do is I'm just going to start out and I'm going to think about the things that we need to keep track of in Unravel and in the Patreon and in the shop and in um, in Enfys and Cariad, the uh, Made Me um, store and stuff like that. And from there, I'm going to see if I've got enough dividers <laughs> because um, right now, how many have we got? One, two, three, four, five. We have five dividers. Um, I might have to go and make five more, I'm thinking. Um, I will have to check that out. Um, I don't think, I mean, the daily grind thing, that could be a work-related section. And then, you know, the weekly is actually where the daily stuff goes in. Um, but I know how much space Faye wants for her, her daily um, things that she writes down daily. So I will be working on that. It's all about bullet points and listing to start out with. So let's see. I guess I'll act like a, uh, I'll act as an example. So if you're setting up your diary, take prompts from me. Um, let's do this. Okay, I'm going to get a note thingy. Yeah, that's a technical term right there. A note thingy. I'm just going to grab this page here. And I'm going to make a list of things to put in here. So we need, I'm going to write in something that you can see. There we go. Nice big black pen. Um, so we want dailies, week to view, right? And that is, I know that if we do a week to view, that's enough space for what Faye likes to write down on a daily basis, which is, we don't do to-do lists anymore. We decided to change up the game and do ta-da lists. And that's basically when you've finished something, you write it down and you celebrate it. Rather than having this big list of what needs to be done and not finishing it and feeling bad about that, we're celebrating the positives what we have done. And that's something that she does on her week to view. So we need that. And let's see what else we need. We need dailies. We need month to view um, and in month to view we need YouTube stats we need um, and other social media so we need that let's see month to view YouTube stats other social media um, and I think we need things like design, sales, um, post scheduler, and that is for Insta. Pinterest, blog, YouTube, and Patreon. That's a lot of stuff to go in one section. Um, so post scheduler, so she'll have her design notes somewhere. Although I'm going to put a question mark there because she has her own design book and it's separate to the planner. So I don't know whether she wants it to be in the same section, but we'll try it. If, if she needs it, we'll try it. Okay, so let's see. We got dailies, to do list, month to view, design, sales, post scheduler. Trying to think what else. Uh, 
Oh, well, under Patreon, we've got um, regular posts and workshop tier posts. We've got a workshop coming up very soon. And if you're just watching this and you're on the ordinary, normal, non-workshop tier per month, um, if you if you actually upgrade to workshop tier, we're doing a Masu box workshop, which is about making um, Japanese style boxes, but we're going to twist it up a bit and we're going to add our own modern decorative touches to it and stuff like that. And uh, it really doesn't require a lot of equipment or tools. So um, if you upgrade to the workshop tier, you will see your uh, supply list, which is not very long and uh, when it's going to be happening. It is going to be toward the end of October. So you've got time. Okay, um, but I digress. All right, so dailies, month to view. Um, that is a tracker thing. I think tracking things on month to view. Okay, so um, YouTube stats and scheduling. So you got two months to views, one for social media stats, one for scheduling. That will be good. Um, color, white, there we go. You need lots of room to write and it's gotta be real visible. So, gosh, that's five tabs. How many tabs did I say were in this diary? One, two, three, four, five. Ah, interesting. Um, we probably will need some extra bits as well. I'm just going to think like extra paper for now because we definitely need extra paper in, in a planner. So we got that. Um, oh, I'm trying to think. Well, you know what? This is just a personal message to Faith. You remember anything else you want to put on here, let me know. Um, so I guess my plans for next time, and this is, this is what we'll do next time. Cause this is going to be a whole new thing. Uh, somebody else's planner. Goodness me. Uh, next time let's do uh, pimp dividers. How about that? We shall pimp the dividers next time. And uh, I will think of other things we can do and I will write them on this list and we will go through them and it'll just be a whole journey, won't it? I'm excited, are you? Stay tuned for all the next following installments of uh, Making Faye's New Diary for 2021. It's happening and it's coming sooner than we all think as well. So it's just a bit of a chat today, a bit of a, it was kind of an unboxing of sorts because it, it was, we took it out of storage. So that's kind of fun. That's like shopping without spending any money because you've already spent it. So I like doing things like that, doing a nice storage deep dive. I've been doing that lately myself, um, coming up with new ideas and new, new things to do. So have you done a dive recently? Tell us in the comments below. And uh, I will see you next week for Plan With Me and actually Plan With Faye, really. I don't know what to call it yet. I'm sure we decided on something last night, but I just can't remember. I've been Cy. This has been Unravel and Unwind. Plan With Me. See you next week. Bye-bye.